Welcome to this edition of JJ on Atlanta, Peachtree TV's community affairs show that looks at all the things that make Atlanta great. Today, we take a look at a healthier Atlanta by visiting with the executive director of HECA. We find out how to cope with cancer and your career, and we give you tips on how to be a better spouse. So join me on this wonderful Sunday morning. This is JJ on Atlanta. Welcome back to the show. How do we build an educated, healthier community? Well, one organization is dedicated to making Atlanta citizens aware of the benefits of a healthy lifestyle and its effect on the community as a whole. Here to talk about the Health, Education, and Communication Center of Atlanta is its executive director, Gary Cobb. Gary, how are you? I'm doing good. Doing great. Great to be here. It is nice to see you. And you know, I love the, the length of the name, the title of your organization. <laughs> But you know what we're going to call it for the remainder of the, this thing? HECA. That's it. HECA That's works, it. right? That's it. That works. That works. Give our viewers an overview of what HECA is. Okay. HECA is a nonprofit, 501c3, based right here in Atlanta, Georgia. Mm -hmm. uh, we were created to support Governor Purdue's Live Healthy Georgia campaign. Right. So from our inception, it's always been about uh, the promotion of health and wellness and changing the landscape of health for our community. And it's been that way, and we've been doing it here in Atlanta and throughout Georgia. Who do you serve? What, 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 what elements of the population here in Atlanta do you serve? Well, when we first started, it was very interesting. We always started off at the very beginning just with the citizens, just with the citizens of Georgia. And then as over time, we started paying a special emphasis to the youth. Because as we found, as we started really getting educated ourselves, youth in Georgia uh, is not a good list to be on, but we have a high, high health issue when it comes to a lot of our children here. Mm -hmm. So we started doing that. And then over time, we even developed to be even further to our businesses. What we were finding was that there were a lot of businesses out here in, in Georgia that wanted to do something in the community, but just didn't know what to do. Mm -hmm. So we came in and said, well, what if we help you? Company A over here wants to get involved with the community. Company B wants to. If we can bring those companies together, we can make a more powerful impact and we can reach far more people. So we started also working with businesses as well to help them with their mission and working with the community as well. You know, you mentioned back there a minute yes. ago some of the issues for kids here yes. in Atlanta and here and in Georgia and probably in the nation. In the nation. Because I'm sure we're not that far off from what, what's going on. No, Real not. quick, what, what are some of those issues that you are dealing with every day? Obesity. Uh, by is far, that number one? That is That's number, number one. one. Right now in Georgia, we rank number three in the country when it comes to childhood obesity for kids between the ages of 10 and 17. I mean, it is absolutely ridiculous where we are. And it looks like we're going to be climbing even farther on that list. Well, when you have children with high obesity, what you're going to then have are adults that have no doubt. hypertension, diabetes, all of the things that are linked to obesity. Mm -hmm. So that is why we pay such close attention to the children, because that is our future. Those are our future right. leaders. So we have to start there. Right. Very hard audience to get to, and, and that's really where we come into play at. Well, yeah. oh, let's, okay, let, let, let's go into that a little bit. Yeah. How do you reach that audience yeah. and ch make those changes that are so important to our community? Well, one of the ways that we do it, I mean, you know, first of all, our, our, our mission is to change the health landscape of, of Georgia, but we do that through creative programming. That is what we do. We look at not what companies have been doing for the past years, but what is a fresh, out-of-the-box view of looking at it. We got this famous saying, you got to meet people where they are. Now, nice. we know that children nice. are the hardest to get to. Because so they're everywhere. They're everywhere. <laughs> they're everywhere. But, you know, you got video games that occupy their time. you got so many other things that just occupy their time. How can we do it? So we decided to link them to things that we know they love. Mm -hmm. We know they love sports. Yes. We know they love music. So what we try to do is give them those things. But as a part of that package, it's the health component. Wait a minute. Not the sugar to help the medicine <laughs> go down. That's it. That's it. That's outrageous. <laughs> That is exactly, Who would have thought of that? <laughs> that is exactly <laughs> our approach. we got to sugarcoat the message and make it easier to right, take. Right. And that's what we do. That's what we do. How do you do it? Well, one of the things that we do is that, you know, for instance, we work very closely with the school systems, okay? okay? Uh, DeKalb County Foundation, Atlanta Public Schools, and mm -hmm. we go in and we actually survey kids to find out what they love. Oh. What do they like? Okay? And once we see that, then we say, okay, this is the program base, for instance, with 
our, our big program. We found that by a hoop Atlanta, by uh, and you know we're gonna I get know to we're that. Get to well, that. You, you go ahead and go on with your basketball. Okay. That's good. <laughs> hoop Atlanta. Hoop Atlanta. <laughs> basketball <laughs> was by far the favorite sport, and and of course it, it has to do with a lot of our stars <laughs> that we have, the LeBron James and those. So if we know that we have kids that love that sport. Let's go ahead and give them that sport, but then let's package it with some of the things and the messages that we want to relate to them. So it's all about packaging for us, and right. that's what we try to do. Now, Hoop Atlanta is a huge, yeah. you know, event for you guys. Yes, yes. And as you said, not only is it packaging that good message, mm -hmm. but you know what? The kids are having a good time. Not only yeah. the kids. Talk a little bit about what Hoop Atlanta is, when it is, and uh, you know, all the information concerning well, that. Well, Hoop Atlanta is all about physical activity. That's what it's about. It's about getting our kids moving, but also their parents, too. Uh, this year's event is July 31st down at the uh, Georgia World Congress Center. Nice. Uh, it includes several components. This year, we got a fun component. we got the Atlanta Dream uh, Dads and Daughters 2-on-2 two -two Tournament. Uh-oh! <laughs> Could be sh some shaking and baking down there. It's going to be good. <laughs> and then, then we got the Converse Youth 3-on-3 three three tournament for all of the youth. And then we have the Corporate Challenge 2-on-2. Two two. So if the dad want to show his dad how to really do it, he has a place that he can come out and do it, too. Uh, you, uh, you got some stretches around when them old dudes uh, we, throw out a leg or got, a hip? We got Grady on standby. <laughs> <laughs> we got Grady on standby just waiting for Because you know how we go. I know, you know how, how we got to do We're not going to try to let them young kids show us what it's like. That's what it's all about. <laughs> but, but the most important component about that is the Sports and Health Expo. The way we do this is that the kids can't participate in any of the fun activities like the three-point contest, right. the hot shot contest, unless they go over to the health expo, learn something about their health, then they get a ticket, and then they can go in and play all the fun games they want. And nice. that thing is learn all day, play all day. And the great thing about Hoop Atlanta is for any skill level, if, if you're just starting out, we got a court for you. We got over 60 courts out wow, there. Wow, that that's neat. So it's for all experience levels, all age ranges. Yeah. You've got a number of partners. You know, you mentioned a couple of them, and please re-mention them again if you would like. Okay. But that's what helped. That's what what helps you go. Yes. Give them a shout out. Give them a thanks. This is the time. By far, Converse is our number one partner here in the Atlanta area. Their dedication to uh, getting kids active and the Atlanta community matched our efforts. So they are our title sponsor of not only the Hoop Atlanta Classic, but also the Hoop Atlanta Bounce Back program, which is the community component as well. We work with Resurgence Orthopedics. They are a great partner. Uh, 790 The Zone, yes. uh, Powerade, uh, Best Buy, uh, just a host. Fit Atlanta Magazine, uh, they're a big sponsor as well. So we work with several companies that really make this possible. This is something that the, the need is so great, we could never do it by ourselves. Sure. We need those type of partners to really come in, assist us, help us, give us fresh ideas, and, and that's how we do it. Okay. Yeah. How about, real quick, mm -hmm. your website and yeah. kind of what's, what's next? Okay www.hoopatlanta.com. That is where you go to find out all the exciting information about the programming and, and everything that we're doing. And what's next for us is this. Our goal is to really pay close, close attention to Atlanta. Next, we also have another organization, the Health Education and Communication System of America. Good <laughs> Lord have mercy. So that is gonna be, that's going to be HECA too. So don't Hecka worry. Too. Yeah, right, exactly. <laughs> So our goal is to make this an example and then take it to other places. The thing about this, you, you, you said it earlier, Atlanta and Georgia is not the only place that's having these type of issues. Right. We got these issues all over the country. So our goal is to take it there. Fantastic. All Listen, right. Gary, thank you so much for being here Enjoyed with us. Enjoyed being here. And we do appreciate it. Enjoyed it. Thank good you luck. Keep, on up the, keep up the good work. Thank you. I appreciate right. it. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with more. JJ on Atlanta.